Despite the dismal weather and shadow of war, love was celebrated in Ukraine's capital as hundreds joined the first Pride celebrations since the start of the Russian invasion. Many called for the legalization of same-sex marriage, whilst others showed support for LGBTQ soldiers. It's very important to show who we really are and to discuss our rights. Now is the time. Now it's very important to introduce the draft law in order to introduce registered partnerships and be visible. It's important. Despite their heroic status, LGBTQ soldiers do not benefit from the same rights as their fellow servicemen. The lack of civil rights for same-sex couples in Ukraine means partners of dead or injured LGBTQ soldiers may not be informed of the fate of their loved ones. I think a lot of people are facing this for the first time. For many comrades, I was the first LGBT person they had ever seen. They treated me like an alien. There were a lot of questions. But when we talked a lot and clarified our boundaries, everything became very easy. They understood everything. There's just a fear of doing something wrong. The celebrations were under heavy police protection as nationalist groups held a counter demonstration, chanting homophobic slurs. Analysts say Ukraine's lack of LGBTQ rights threatens to hinder its process of joining the European Union, an aim for the government amidst the war. As Sunday's protests show, a country divided on more than one front.